Hello, this is Aaron with InetComputers.com with another video for you today. Hola, bueno, este es Ron con InetComputers.com. Otro video para ti hoy. I filed this one under software problemos. Windows installer service cannot be accessed when you try to install iTunes. You have downloaded latest version of iTunes, but when you try to install it, you get an error message. Quote, the Windows installer service cannot be accessed. This can occur if you are running Windows in safe mode or if the Windows installer is not currently installed. Contact your support personnel for assistance. Unquote. That's quite a lengthy error. You are not running Windows in safe mode. Log on to your computer as an administrator. Click your start button and then click run. In an open box, type CMD and then click OK. At a command prompt, type M-S-I-E-X-E-C dot E-X-E space forward slash unregister without quotes and then press enter type msiexec space for slash reg server without quotes and then press enter verify that a system account has full control access permissions to a h key underscore classes underscore root hive in a windows registry in some cases you may also have to add administrator accounts click your start button and then click run type reg edit in an open box and then Click OK. Click a following registry hive h key underscore classes underscore root. On an edit menu, click permissions. If system is not listed in a group or usernames list, click add. Make sure that your local computer name appears in a from this location box. Type system in and enter the object names to select box. Click check names and then click OK. Click system in a group or usernames list and then select a full control checkbox under allow in a permissions for system box click apply click OK and then quit registry editor make sure that a system account has full control access permissions to a H key underscore classes underscore root hive in a Windows registry I have included a sample image of what security permissions for a H key underscore classes underscore root hive should look like click on system under group or usernames when editing that hive in Windows registry permissions for system should have check marks under allow or full control and read if a system entry does not exist under group or usernames then follow please follow instructions below to add it on an edit menu click permissions if system is not listed in a group or usernames list click add make sure that your local computer name appears in a from this location box type system in and enter the object names to select box click check names and then click OK click system in a group or usernames list and then select a full control checkbox under allow in a permissions for system box click apply click OK and then quit registry editor so after all that hopefully iTunes works you can always browse to anacomputers.com for other possible potential tips, information, and tricks to help you solve your most common computer problems. Thank you for listening. Adios.